Hello, I'm excited to tell you about SDScribe 2016. SDScribe was developed to save you time and money creating safety data sheets for the products that you manufacture. Our product is used by many manufacturers in a variety of industries. This video will provide a brief demonstration of some of the key features. You are encouraged to watch other videos to learn more about some of the specific functionality that we included in our product to help save you time. SDScribe is organized like a safety data sheet with 16 sections. There is a numbered tab corresponding to each of the sections of an SDS, for example, identification, hazards, composition, and some of the sections are divided into several tabs. You can navigate to any section by clicking on the tab or by selecting the section from our navigation drop-down. In addition to creating SDSs, our product also creates text and pictograms for GHS compliant labels. Watch our videos on labels to learn more about this functionality. Our product is all about simplicity. Basically, whatever you enter into any of the text boxes will appear where you expect it once you build the SDS. To build an SDS, go to the Build Report tab and click on the Generate SDS Text button. Notice that you can select different formats, including compact ones. Just check off the boxes. You can even include NFPA and HMIS in either graphic or just text format. After building your SDS, you can save it as a Word document. In addition, you can batch export numerous SDSs into either Word documents or PDFs. We will illustrate how to use the product by creating a safety data sheet for 10% formalin. In Section 1, you will notice that much of the data about our company, such as our company name, and even our logo is automatically populated for us once we create a new SDS. In Section 3, we will enter the components of the mixture. Press the plus button and type in either the chemical name or the CAS number. Notice that the exposure limits and regulatory information will be carried over into the SDS from the component substance record. We will then enter the concentration of the component. Notice that the component has already been GHS classified. Now that we have entered the components, we will go to Section 2 and enter the GHS hazards of the mixture, if there are any. We will take advantage of our built-in suggestion wizard by clicking on the suggestion button. This valuable tool will suggest health hazards of the product based on the classifications of the components and their concentrations relative to cutoff limits. We will accept the health hazards and press OK to have the associated pictograms, hazard, and precautionary statements, and even signal word entered into the table. To create sections such as first aid and firefighting, we encourage you to take advantage of our built-in stock phrase library. The product comes with over 100 stock phrases. These can be used to quickly add text to each of your sections. Note that the program recognizes where you are and will present the stock phrases specific to that section of the safety data sheet. As we mentioned before, to save you time, several sections of the safety data sheet will be populated with applicable data as you add chemical components. For example, in the exposure section, we see the applicable exposure limits that were entered as we entered formaldehyde. SDS Scribe was developed to save you time and money creating safety data sheets for products that you manufacture. We have many satisfied customers who have benefited by our product. Feel free to download a free 10-day trial. If you purchase it, you will not need to reinstall a different product. Anything you enter during the trial period is not lost. Thank you very much.